the <laughs> racing update. Oh, oh, the racing update. Yes. Let's, let's get uh, right into it. Get right into it here. Let's hear about what's going on at the Poconos. Yeah. Take it away, Abe Miranda. <laughs> Somebody's going to be Your life's the racer. See it through. Go speed racer. Go speed racer. Go speed racer. Go. He's up and flying as he guns a car around the track. He's jamming down the pedal like he's never coming back. Adventure's waiting just for him. You ever watch Speed Racer? Go speed racer. Go speed racer. Go speed racer. Go. 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 It's exciting. Once again, we are here in Newport Beach mm-hmm. to talk about our Chab Dog Sports Racing segment mm. and talk a little bit about NASCAR. Vroom. All right, guys. So let me uh, bring up and let's talk a little about last week. Mm. So last week we had our Ambetter uh, 301. This was our New Hampshire. Yes. This was the New Hampshire. It was the New Hampshire Motor Speedway. Mm. You know how close I came last week to picking Christopher Bell? How close? I was very close. Oh, that's... Because he was, he was one of the, the lower... There, there was a lower probability of him winning. The odds were good. And William Byron and him were right next to each other on that chart you uploaded. And I took William Byron. You should have trusted your instinct, Christopher my Bell run the, rung the bell. Christopher Bell. He rung he, the bell. He killed it. He killed it in New Hampshire. Yeah. And he ended up winning that race. Guess who won? Who was in second place? Chase Elliott. Ah! <laughs> Is that right? <laughs> yeah. That <was> <laughs> you guys are handing it. it to me. And you, you guys are handing it to and me. And you picked Chase it. Elliott? Of course I did. Oh, nice. Yeah, so you, already, I already knew he was already got, doing good. You got two more points. That's okay. I got so you're back up. You're up to I'm, 10 I'm now? I'm back up there, yeah. Okay. I'm at 10 now. I just want you on notice. Now I'm getting serious. This, this marks this. I'm no more dawdling around. No, here no, on no. In, it's you got to dial it in, bro. Scorched earth. You're, you got 11. I know. I got 10. Blix got 8. I wanted to make this interesting. So well, Red's I got 7. And Dorothy, late, I know. late to the game. But right. you got five, 5 points. Chase Elliott was So really 2 points, there. that was all the points that, that were given out that last week. That was it because <sighs> Bubba Wallace came in third and nobody picked Bubba Wallace. So uh, nobody how picked did, how, did, how did William Byron do? William Byron, let's take a look. I got him right here. Um... I will tell you that Martin Truex Jr. came in fourth. And that's a big who cares because that's not worth any points. No, unfortunately. But if you had just just a little bit more, Eric could have walked okay. away from the point here. But let's yeah. see. Mm, William. No, no, because sorry. Truex came in fourth. <laughs> <laughs> I, I missed a point. You Byron, were shafted. Position. Yeah, Byron came in 11. 11. That's not 11. bad. That's not too bad. Who'd you pick, Dorothy? She picked Joey Logano. Oh, I think Joey he did Logano. well. I think he got like six or something. Let's see, where's Didn't Logano? He? Wait a minute, who came in 11? The 11 guy. Her guy. The 11. Mm. Joey Logano 11. came in 24th. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Good. Not too no? distinguished. No, I like 11 better. The 11. <laughs> there we go. Mm. Okay, so enough about New Hampshire. That's old news. What about what's okay. this week's race is where? Poconos? Yeah, so this race, this is the Pocono Raceway. And actually, Pocono this one's really Speedway, cute yes. because this is the M&M's. This is called the M&M's Fan Appreciation 400. So M&M's. M&M's of all, pl- of all places. You know what it should be called? Teams. It should be called the Green M&M's Appreciation Race. <laughs> I call it the Kyle Bush. And greens are the ones that make you horny. Kyle Bush. Okay. <laughs> See? The which one? The, the green M and M's make you horny. Wow! <laughs> Wait, no. wow! Am I the only person who didn't know this? What? I didn't know that. Uh-huh. Well, green M and M's. It's about time you knew that. Really? <laughs> What's going on? 
Apparently, this camera. What is this green M M&M and M thing? We're, we're talking about, about today's you know race. Information? Today's race. Yes. We'll it's the M and M's 400. So uh-huh. I just suggested a more catchy name, a little more racy. Yeah, but when, where's green tie into uh, green? It's greens really? are supposed to make you more wow. sexual. So, okay, we got two people confirming this here. Wow, we, I, I, I didn't they, know. I, I I've I guess been. Yeah, she knew that. <laughs> we're not knew green M and M's. That's why. You didn't, Honey, that's why. You didn't that's try why those I've been on enough performing. dates, did you? I don't know what you're talking about. You, you lost a lot I of have opportunities. I've been underperforming all my life. I have not yeah, you know, that must explain it. M&Ms. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sorry. I didn't know. <laughs> anyway, sorry. Okay. We definitely made a left turn here. Yes, on, a detour. Uh, segment. <laughs> But it's okay. It's all fun so and games. So it's going to be the Eminem Fan Appreciation 400. Is that it? That's okay. right. Oh, and it's going to be at Pocono Raceway, uh-huh. known as the uh-huh. Tricky Triangle. Okay. And it is a super speedway that is located in the Pocono Mountains in Long Pond, Pennsylvania. Mm. It's a two and a half mile track. Long Pong? <laughs> Long Pong. <laughs> Long Pong. dong. Careful. <laughs> Careful. Pond. Long. I don't want to hurt anyone's feelings. Pond. Here. Okay. I just misheard something. That's all. And it's um, really? nineteen. They've been hosting NASCAR races there Long gone so- since nineteen seventy four. So it's okay. been uh, mm. it's been uh, it's been around a while in the NASCAR Cup Series circuit. Mm-hmm. This is an asphalt triangle oval. And um, Pocono. This is Pocono. No disrespect. Is it a triangle or an oval? oval? Make up your mind. It's a triangle. No disrespect. It's, you know, well, that's triangle. not an oval. I mean, oval. it's either one or the other. The it's a rounded triangle. No disrespect of a to the Orientals. Of that okay. No track. disrespect Ooh. to the Orientals. Do we have a photo of that, <laughs> that uh, racetrack? Oh, the racetrack? I get the Poconos up. Yeah, we'll get the Pocono. We'll show you. We're, we're going to show a, you. It's today. a pointy oval. Today we're going to show you what the track looks like. Okay, so it's um, each corner, by the way, of the Pocono Triangle here is kind of modeled after a few other famous ovals. Uh, Turn one, for example, is inspired by the Trenton Speedway. Now, that speedway closed in 1980, but that is to mimic turn one. (coughs) Turn two is actually inspired by the Indianapolis... Motor Speedway. Mm-hmm. So that is number two. You know, that's two. a dangerous thing, actually, when you, you take a track and you make it uneven like that because then the racers have to keep. They can't. That's the fun of it. And that's yeah. why it's called the Tricky Triangle. I wouldn't want to get in. He was mocking that you. Could turn into is the he making fun of me? He could turn into is the Bermuda Triangle. Is he telling me that the racetrack is mm-hmm. hard? Yeah, because you got to remember which turn is the pointier turn. Well, that's. It's called professional race car. You can't get lost in a moment as well. You know, it's it's when you're playing baseball and everybody shifts to right field. You as a batter got to shoot this thing on left field. Can I ask your opinion on something? What's that? If you think about the sports that somebody could do well when they're high, high. I think racing would be the lowest one on the list. (laughs) 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 Yeah. Because it's five miles an hour. You know, because time slows down. <laughs> <It's not good. laughs> Racing. I mean, you'd and be being so happy, high, but you'd be so you'd, behind. Yeah. I'd be lapped about 50 <laughs> times on that car. I'd be going 35. They'd yeah. be like, they'd be the like dude. <laughs> what do you think yeah, the yeah, best yeah, sport yeah. would be to do stoned? Stoned. Oh, God. Air hockey. I think uh, I think darts. <laughs> air hockey. Air hockey. For me, darts. I think air hockey is you see the puck go a little slower. Because <laughs> you concentrate so well. How about golf? Golf. That's a golf. possibility, yeah, actually. So. That's, that's a, a possibility. It's going to hurt. Man, as long as the marshal didn't get on you. Because you know? you're playing slowly in the marshal. Oh, yeah. The marshal will be up on your butt if you were know. stoned. The motor bowling? game sped on. Bowling. Bowling. Don't play too slow. Bowling. Don't play too slow. Like, bowling. Just okay. Bowling. Can, we try, can we try that sometime? Uh, you want to go bowling with me? I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> there you bowling. go. Yes. No, you don't hate it. I know you don't. Like no. We just That's can't fun. tell them if anybody's getting stoned, okay? Washington All Redskins, right. go so, fuck yourself. Yeah. 
So the first turn has 14 degrees of banking. The second turn has nine degrees of spanking. 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 And, uh, Did he say uh, spanking? spanking? I heard that. Ba spanking? What is that? <laughs> that was a Freudian That's the scene. joke. <laughs> and uh, turn turn three uh, has six degrees of banking. So spanking. Uh, so, so yes, yeah, so each corner has a different degree of banking. So what is your point? That's Very also tricky. That point. makes it tricky as <laughs> so well. That's, what, well. That's the point. The point is, is tricky. Pure energy. No, like, you know, this one's banks more. This one mm -hmm. banks less. So these, you got to keep this in consideration when but you're racing. But there's three corners. But there's only four three corners. corners in a box, but there's three corners. There's only three one. corners. At the I'm sorry. Somebody's going to right right. yeah, get very uh, badly uh, injured in, in this creep, 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 creep right. trap. Beautiful uh, thing. So, and, okay, you know, and, hey, and that's I, I got a stupid question. And everything ask a in the middle question? is RVs, by the way. Can I ask you a stupid question, RVs? please? Uh -huh. I really want to ask what? a stupid question. Ask me a stupid question. Go Are they going clockwise or counterclockwise? They're going to be going They go counterclockwise. All left. All to the left. Okay, so they're going counterclockwise. This is the northern hemisphere. Everything goes counterclockwise. We only make left turns. In Australia, they'd be going right. but Yes, if we were in the other hemisphere, everything would be going the other direction. the steering wheel was in the other side. There's more information available at Chapter Law. We're making right hand Give us your retainer today. We're making left. We're only going left. So it's going to be. can tell you what, Pava, for all the wrong information. You guys are funny. They better be trying It sounded good. Look at all those RVs. See, you can go camping right in there. Look at that. You go camping. I love it. I know. Like, it's fun. I'm not That's saying some like, good thing. Bring your, bring your, and it's in the Poconos. Camper. The Poconos, which it's is in, in the uh, it's, is that it's, New York or New York. Pennsylvania? Uh, that's like, New that's northern Pennsylvania. Okay. See, it's oh. northern Pennsylvania. Right. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. 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 It's northern Pennsylvania. There's a lot there, of New York. A lot of trees. A lot of people go there on vacation, right? It's a big vacation spot, isn't it? Yes. I have vacation yeah, there. Uh, yeah. I skied there. My mom grew up in it's Brooklyn, and a lot of people went to the Poconos. Uh -huh. Brooklyn? Yeah. Wow. It's, it's no great joke. for skiing. Back, back in the day, we used to go. Yeah. So, you know, matter mm -hmm. of fact, we, Frank and I uh, recently went on a road trip. We went from New Jersey to Cleveland. We oh. actually drove through. I bet you're the kind of guy that went <laughs> through that. Fuck area. a person in the ass and not. There you mm. go. I, the reach I, around. Yeah, that's that's pretty. It's a long winded way to get there, right? But the yeah, start. no, yeah, I guess it's central, central kind of Pennsylvania. Mm -hmm. but well, you went right through. We went right. through it. You went from we, one end to the we other. We were going it's a long state, from New Jersey yeah. all the way to Cleveland. Mm. Yeah, and uh, matter of fact, when we were sh we're filming our show mm. a couple mm. weeks ago from the car, mm. yes. where Frank was really mm. wide awake on that show, mm -hmm. uh, we <laughs> we. Get them, dogs. We actually <laughs> saw signs, uh, Pocono mm -hmm. Mountains and things like that. And we actually stopped at a hot mm -hmm. dog place mm -hmm. that um, <clears throat> was 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 along the mm -hmm. ride there. It was very nice. I think mm -hmm. Penn State is Penn near State. there. Penn State. State. Yeah. yeah. Penn okay. State. Yeah. So. Joe Paterno, Sandusky. Yeah. yeah exactly. And movie monster. Dirty Dancing that was set in the Poconos. It was very. It was yeah. very quiet. It was very baby, beautiful. Don't, it was very what's nice. What's that famous line with baby? Don't. I don't remember. In the corner. Anyway. <laughs> no, no, nobody puts baby. Nobody puts corner. baby in the corner. There we go. <laughs> so let's see what's going on. <laughs> well, as as, so who's looking good for the Poconos race? Well, um, unfortunately, here's the thing. What? Practice, practice is actually practice. Does, practice. practice. We you love winners. Practice, but practice. Thank started you. At Eleven thirty this oh. morning, and qualifying don't start until one twenty. So we don't today. have any information. Washington Redskins, go fuck yourself. Okay. There you go. You know what? Well, I, I do have some information for you because I got the betting. I got the betting odds. Oh, but what we are have the betting odds. Because okay. I'm going to tell you who I'm picking right now. So this is courtesy of Barstool Sportsbook and Casino. Barstool Sports. I want to grab. Man, we're making some people really happy on the East Coast. Right Chad now, dog for sports a talk, and we're, this is our so positive is our, our a thousand. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make some money today. So you gonna do true X? Yes. I okay, can't believe we just because this is the terrible you know, triangle. Dude. You can't mess with my. That's my dude. Man. Well, you, you can pick him too. Look at Kyle Bush. Bush. Jump on Kyle with the Bush. jab. Dog. M and M day. Dude. That's that's a good thing. I had the idea first. That's all. All right. So what's I knew you were gonna call it in legal terms. That's a parent authority. I wanted to steal your son. Chab dog said it. I'm taking Kyle. Or taking True X Junior. Yeah. Pound sand. There's the other guy. All right, so let me write that down. Right, write so that he's going to take Truex Jr., huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. Martin Truex oh, Jr. Okay. Yeah, for a thousand. So I'm I know so Blix is bank, probably so. going to go with Kyle Busch. Right. How boring. Default right there. Mm -hmm. Now we've got. Now, what a Bush League move. Everybody else. We've got the whole field left okay. here. So. <clears throat> 
who do I like on this race? Yeah, you should have gone first because you won. Where's the but Where's I, the I, I that's just okay. preempted that. you. Uh, well, Abe, yeah, he wasn't going to take him anyway. Where is he? <coughs> Look at Denny <coughs> Hamlin's oh, guy. Man. Denny Hamlin's got good luck. I don't know, Kyle man. Kyle Larson's got Look at Chase Elliott again. William man. Byron might hot. do it again. Dorothy, you want Chase Elliott this week? Who do you want? You want Kyle Larson, Denny Hamlin? Wow, tricks is awesome. How about Christopher Roll? Who's that? Our Christopher. Bell. <laughs> Christopher Bell. He's you the one that won last week. You want that one? Hey, that's, maybe he's that's hot. That's like two in a row. You're that's, going for two in a row. Let him go. We, hey, he, he just needs to get on the podium. Either that Three, guy two, or one. are the trucks, Jr. Or Truex or, Jr.? Yeah. That's who I picked. Truex Jr., join well, me. We could do double picks. We've done that before, too. I'm so telling you, Chab Dog's re leading this thing for a reason. My my um, gut says Truex Jr. Your gut yeah, says Truex Jr. Yeah, going with me. Jr. Martin Truex going to What have about you? Do you want to jump on the bandwagon? Yeah, Gosh, I would love to I jump on get the these. I want to lift everybody I'm up. I'm trying to beat you guys. There we go. So I, I want to lift you all up. See it all. Okay, so. Second pick for Truex Jr. No. Yeah, no. this is the week I'm not taking him. <laughs> I don't. I like him when I can get him by myself. Two. In, a, in the corner. You have two for Truex. Jones. Alex Bowman, 2000. Joey Logano. Ooh. Alex Bowman is enticing. He's, oh, that was a that's a good bet. Oh, Joey Logano. 2000. Look at that. Joey Logano for at a plus 1800. That's great. I mean, Kurt Busch for 2000. Oh, so oh yeah, Kurt Busch is good. Who's taking Kurt? I haven't. I was thinking about taking Kurt Busch. You know, oh, did you I make feel a like pick I okay. haven't. But we got a Kyle Leonard. Busch and then Kurt Busch. Tyler Reddick, twenty five hundred. These are oh, good. Oh, Daniel names. Suarez. Mm -hmm. Suarez. Suarez. Three thousand yeah, plus three thousand. Uh, Can you imagine Bubba's, that? Why is Bubba so expensive or like so such good? Well, because he's uh, well, he did. He got on the podium. He last, just hasn't last, won in a long time. Chase Briscoe is also he's chasing it. Yeah, he's, he's Kozlowski. Yeah. That's real bad. Austin Cindric sounds like a comedian. At Five thousand. It's going to be really good this week. Eric Jones. That's a wow. I right, know you're Austin really Dillon. scraping the bottom of the barrel. Cole Custard. Oh boy. <laughs> Michael McDowell. M and M's. M and M's race. Yeah. I don't know. Might have to go with that. Ty Dillon. Jeez, uh, funny. We do know some of these names though. We're getting better here in our. Yeah. Okay, there we are. Scraping the bottom of the barrel. One hundred and fifty thousand to one. I didn't even see William Byron. Yeah, love plus. Uh, you don't see that very often. <clears throat> I think. I think he's my. <sighs> It's so good. Denny Hamlin looks good too. Yeah. Denny Hamlin, look at that. Denny Hamlin looks good. How about some more looks? How about some Cole Custer? Ooh. That's not. I, I, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to go I, with. I, I got to take a diet. I'm going to. Well, oh, there's I'm William Byron. Byron. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. 1100. Yeah, I got to pick a winner. Lord here, Byron. So. He can win. Give me Joey Logano plus 1800. Okay. Joey Logano. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Joey Logano. And did we hear who you were taking? I'm going to go with, um, I want to go with Kyle Larson again. You know, I know he's my regular, but he hasn't won anything. And he's been kind of like, I think it's his time. And this this is a tricky triangle. And the yeah. guy races a lot. So, a time, eh? and, I, and I like Kyle Busch, but Blick's already got Kyle Busch. And Martin Trux is good. And Chase Elliott, he's good. He's got on the podium. Mm -hmm. So it's between Chase Elliott and Kyle Larson again. And and I like I'm going Get to yourself. Larson. Okay, fine. Whoa. Kyle Larson. Yes, Kyle Larson. Go. Put me down for Larson. Down for Larson. Kyle with a K. I'll be kind of pissed if Elliott gets on the podium now. <laughs> Bend over here. It comes again. <laughs> you never know. How about you, Well Red? Please pick Chase Elliott for me. At least you'll get on the podium. I think you'll get some points. Oh, no, no, I'm taking Jerry Logano. Oh, yeah, Logano. Yeah, he already did. All right, so we're all uh, locked in with our picks. Yes. You got anything to tell us about Formula One, by the way? Let's see. What's you haven't talked doing? much about Formula One. Yeah, you know, I just, I've just i been out on the road a lot, and, yeah. and it's, it's busy, just man. been crappy. You only have so much time in the day. Great time with. I mean, come on. I mean, but I had a great. I mean, yeah. I mean, I came back. I I went as like pink. Okay. Green, I heard something. A, a, I, mean, I did hear something I wanted to mention, which What's you that? can comment on. What's I heard that? that they're doing a, a, a one of these big races in Chicago soon. Is that right? Chicago was picked now as a new site for a race. A race. Hmm. Well, there is going to be a Chicago race. On could be as I think. You don't know what it's I'm talking Chicago about? NASCAR street race? Yeah, yeah. What is that? Is that a new race they're adding? Well, let's see. So apparently NASCAR has gotten with the city of Chicago uh -huh. to conduct like a look into a street race. 
in the streets of Chicago, in the middle of Chicago, which would be kind of cool. Yeah, so like while all the robberies are going on, you can have a NASCAR race. And, yeah, uh, so so you better have the the bulletproof glass on the car. That's right, so they're going to snipe you <laughs> yeah. from the from the <laughs> building. Kennedy set up. But actually, it, it Mayor, Mayor like Lightfoot's the waving the checkered this flag. Is, this is I'm glad you brought that up because NASCAR announced oh on Tuesday. Now, now NASCAR announced on Tuesday that we we they will introduce their first street racing street racing circuit Speed for NASCAR uh -huh. uh, and it'll Ooh, be in life. July of 2023 so it's just like a road race through the, the yeah street. it's it's yeah. like a Monaco think yeah. of like a Monaco like a or like rally. going to Dubai except or you're not in Monaco. something you would see in Formula <laughs> One except you're going through the streets of Chicago mm. interesting. <laughs> interesting so okay. I heard there's gonna be one coming in Vegas not that NASCAR, would be cool. Mm -hmm. Racing around we the, the casinos, a, yeah. We yeah. do have that one in cool. NASCAR has a I wanna, they have a, a circuit in I wanna North be in charge Vegas. of that event, man. I know, but oh, that would Formula be a great one. event. Okay, I yes. think it's Formula One yes. that's gonna yes. be the great Vegas event, circuit. man. They need yes. that. Like my boyfriend already wants to get reservations at the hotel. There's gonna to be yeah. Watch yes. It. It's so, going to be a night race in 2023. Uh, so the uh, in November was hey, against it's going to be in once yeah. it was right, finally so, negotiated so all, and all the terms were laid out. I wrote about that. Yeah, in yeah. so it sounds it like we have a street well, race geared up for NASCAR standard. in Chicago next year, mm. and it looks like Las Vegas is going to be having a street. You know, Grand Prix mm -hmm. for Formula One in November, which actually would be pretty oh, cool to go hot. to. So maybe yeah. we can okay. all yeah. look sure. up on that one. That's my birthday That's really time. Mm -hmm. Ah, perfect. And the other thing was, we were, weren't we going to do a parlay or something? We're going to. We're talking about making money doing Jeff parlays. contributions. Sure, let's go to Vegas and play some mm -hmm. So I think the parlay would be to to pick either Chase Elliott. Uh, Martin Truex Jr. or Kyle Well, Larson you really can't do a parlay because they they would all have to win. You can't. You just play separate bets on you each. You play one. separate bets. And would that would that be a good win. strategy? Well, you know, I think that's that would be a good strategy. Parlay, man. What are you, pussy? It's hard. You, you can't do a parlay in racing. You just oh. can't do a parlay. Can't, they don't give it to you. How can you do it? I mean, not with multiple. No, you can't. It's what you can get separate tickets. The only thing would be to bet on different teams to win and see if you can. Oh, you mean at the same time? Betting if there's a parlay that, that allows you to do that. NASCAR, Formula One. No, not. You. Oh, you do a parlay on yeah, Formula One NASCAR. Yeah, no, Ooh, that's going to be tough. You're right. Sorry. Sorry. This is a. Okay, this is an insider. What we're talking about here is a limitation in the system. Did you have enough? I don't think you did. Your mind's not working past his mind. No, this is something I learned from. I thought was kind of weird myself. Why can't you uh, do a parlay of different? You know, well, you can do. Yeah. I guess you can do one for Formula One it, it's and really NASCAR. NASCAR. No, you can do it like they do it for baseball, but they don't have that concept in I, in racing. I mean, I don't know if there's like they don't have it where like they have a bet where you're on the podium. Like if you had a bet that was for I'm on the podium, which is first, second, and third. Yeah. Then you could technically parlay two or three drivers to say these are the top three drivers that are going to win the race oh, like that's in like in horse racing do. like horse racing right? yeah you could do one two and three that's right? why people love you horse racing one two and three because you get those parlays going you really can't do that on, and we were talking about this we we're talking about really this this concept that, that Racing's kind of like roulette you can make a lot of money just because you make different bets on person to win Right, and the payoff's so big. So what I normally do when I'm going to bet on NASCAR, for example, is I make sure that the qualifying is already done, so that I can kind of have an idea and see how the drivers are doing on the racetrack. Right. Then what I do is I make separate bets. Now we're looking at some of those odds look really good, right? Plus three thousand. Two thousand. Plus two thousand. These are good. So what I'll do. Is I, instead of putting, you know, a hundred bucks on Kyle Larson, right, who has plus eight fifty, right? I'm gonna put twenty bucks on Kyle Larson. Right. Then I'm gonna put another twenty bucks on somebody who's getting me plus two thousand. Yeah. Then I'm gonna put another twenty bucks on Kurt Busch, who's getting pretty good odds as well. Well, you're a genius. You know so, that? so what I do is I, I take, I want to make couple bets for NASCAR uh -huh. and and then I rather make four bets for NASCAR at 20 bucks than, than put 80 bucks on Kyle Larson. Yeah, smaller smaller is better. Now, I, now, now it is possible maybe to do a parlay bet where 
You mm. pick the Formula One driver winner, and you pick the NASCAR driver winner. So I could pick Max Verstappen on Formula One, mm. maybe, and then pick Kyle Larson mm. in NASCAR, maybe parlay that. But this is a man who has called women pigs, slobs, and dogs. Oh, okay. Oh, but you can do a parlay on the different Cup Series, maybe. So you got the the. the the truck series, yeah. the Xfinity, and then the NASCAR Cup series. Right. So you can say, I want That's really this guy to win trucks, this guy to win Infinity, and this guy to win Cup that's Series. That's impossible. But that's, that's that's like impossible. That's insane. Yeah. You know, that's who cares about that? I mean, it's hard enough to get <coughs> one one winner on one race series, and then right. to try to. Well, we, we just want to have a few bets. Be plus twenty thousand. I think we just want to sprinkle in a few bets on on those drivers. You know, the ones that sprinkle. I like to sprinkle them. I'm like I'm yeah. like um, I'm like Love Desk. Look, yeah, uh, you're the you're the you're the. I'm like the Tinker Bell. You're the racing NASCAR. fairy. That's yes. what I am. I'm the Tinker Bell. A Abe, the racing I'm the fairy. fairy. I'm the fairy. Here you go. We're gonna, we're gonna sprinkle yeah. some magic. You know, some magic. Hmm. Uh, there's a tooth fairy and there's yeah. a racing fairy. Look, there's Joe Biden. He even thinks I'm a fairy. It's perfect. Do you want me to spell fairy? <laughs> That's Joe Biden. Uh, look, hey, and I'll spell I'll spell does. fairy. Uh, Get lucky. He's Sprinkling, Sprink, sprinkle, 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 oh, sprinkle, sprinkle. No. Kyle Larson. Yeah. It's too easy. Kyle Larson. Quit ganging Kyle up Larson. on the president, will you? I love him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look, he's, Is it time he's to move me. to politics? Kyle Larson. It's going to be Kyle Larson. I thought we were in politics already. It's going to be Kyle Larson. Can we, can we go to politics right now and hear some debate highlights? From the country. And annex the significant.